hey everyone welcome back to another video if you're new to my channel my name is miss tamika i upload videos once a week which is sunday and with that being said you all i have a unboxing so if you here for this here unboxing i know what y'all need to do please click on my subscribe button y'all because it really really because it really really helps out my channel so we're gonna go ahead and jump into this here unboxing before i jump into this here unboxing i wanted to share kind of a update on these here particular flowers a previous video i did i showcased these here flowers they were sent to me and sent to me by the company rose forever this video is not sponsored or whatever i just wanted to share with you all um a quick update on these hair flowers and then i also have a discount code and a link down below for you all just in case you want to purchase some flowers for yourself i had these for a a few weeks now i just wanted to get on here and show you what they look like so far only reason why the petals look like they are kind of falling is because i did drop it y'all yeah i dropped it when i was trying to do something with it um they dropped and one of the petals had came off so i just like stuck it inside of the box and let me just say they have a hint of flower it's a hint of a flower smell when i tell you all they bring so much beauty and light to my room like i love flowers so flowers much so much i go to trader joe's at least once or twice a week to purchase flowers so with having these here flowers you don't have to worry about them for a whole for a year like you don't have to water them you don't have to put them in light you don't have to do none of that you can just sit them somewhere pretty and just let them do what they do hey, you i just wanted to let you know they are still running strong um the box is still pretty I didn't notice it has some lint on it so i just took my lint brush and rubbed it across and everything came completely off so yeah you all i just wanted to share really quick and i was thinking about adding some little diamonds to the top of the flowers just to give it that little extra -ness. i just wanted to say if y'all love flowers like myself i would highly recommend these hair flowers from rose forever so again the link would be across the screen and also it would the discount code would be across the screen and the link would be down below so i just wanted to throw that in here really quick to let y'all know that i love these hair flowers and if y'all are like myself you may want to purchase some for your little uh for your office your desk your girl's room your daughter's room your closet or whatever so yeah i do keep them in my room like on my um nightstand before i open this hair box i did share a video uh, not a video i did share a picture of four bags and when i tell y'all some of y'all know miss tamika like some of y'all was dead on and i was just like oh my goodness like y'all my girlfriends y'all my true true girlfriends y'all when i tell you y'all know me very well it's like smiling to myself like see this is why i love my youtube friends like for real the ones who love these you know who love bags as much as i do like y'all get me like we here you know we here with the whole bag thing so yeah today i am here to reveal the bag i ended up purchasing that being said you all i did purchase it i did purchase this bag from Saks. i didn't purchase from the actual website and if y'all didn't know it is a saint laurent bag this is my first time ever purchasing saint laurent fingers crossed as good as it as it is um in person now the reason why i purchased the bag i did try it on multiple times like when i was vacationing in orlando i did try it on when i was in philly at king of pressure i tried it on so i tried it on a, a few times but for me i felt like it was time to just purchase the bag that i was really really interested in i was interested in the toy what was it the toy lulu small that one was more expensive so i was feeling like okay if i start small and if I like this, I can work my way up to that Same. side because, you know, I just came off a of vacation. So, so I was like, okay, let me get this bag home and really, really play with it. Like, the lady was nice. She let me put my stuff in it. But, you know, it's nothing like taking the bag home, trying it on, putting your stuff in it, and really getting the full feel of the bag. So, this is why I purchased the bag myself. Okay, so here is the inside of the box. It just came today, you all. I am so excited. Okay. Here is the bag, y'all. I am so excited. Y'all know how I get when I unbox bags. I love bags. If it was up to me, y'all, I would purchase bags all the time. Like, y'all, I really, really love bags, y'all. I'm telling you. It's been something I've been loving since I was a little girl. 
let me see because this light is hard to see the bag it felt like i felt like it was a little too bright oh my goodness you all so like i said this is my first ysl bag y'all my first and ever so here is the box you all your girl has her first black ysl saint laurent box i'm so happy like i am i'm happy oh comes with your black dust bag and then it also comes with your saint laurent card it's an official saint laurent but you know what i don't even think that could um that really states that it's an official bag because with these here replicas i think they even replicate the um cards and stuff so <laughs> all right Okay, so I'm excited to say that the bag is not used because I was a little scared because when I was looking at the tracking information, um, it was showing that it was coming from another sex store. So I was just like, you know how I, you know, if you follow me for a while, y'all know my, my situations and my issues with stuff coming from stores sometimes because a lot of times, you know, people give you used things. I don't want to say used things, but you know, things that was opened or returned or whatever. And I do return things myself, but but yeah, anyway, like I was saying, it came. So it doesn't have any drawstrings on the side. Oh, wait a minute, do it? Okay, yeah, it do. So it has this here drawstring here on the side, which is cute. Because anytime I purchase bags, I always, always keep them in their dust bags, plastic bags, or whatever they come in, that's what I put them back in. Except for my mark jacobs because they came in like plastic and i just threw them away anytime i purchase gucci louis vuitton or whatever i always keep them stored in my closet in their dust bags since this is our first since this is my first ysl we're gonna go ahead and open this here little envelope before we go ahead and get started because i just i'm just curious to see what's in the inside of this like i said this is my first ysl bag y'all i'm so excited y'all so it just tells you the name of the bag and yeah just a little saint laurent card information so just wanted to look inside to see like this here stuff i always keep together so like if i ever want to resell for whatever reason i have everything together so what's this so now are y'all ready for everyone who picked the number one y'all were correct y'all were dead on like yes i picked the number one bag i think it was number one on the picture like i said again anyone who picked number one y'all were dead on like i think when i first posted that picture someone picked one and i just smiled because i was like damn they know me very very well like just because i'm through you know just because i talk to y'all through the computer or through youtube it's like you know we girlfriends you know this is the bag that i chose because like i said this one here uh, was one of the ones that I tried on. I tried on a few different bags. Like I said, I would have preferred to have got the small. But then I was like, small, but I just couldn't justify that amount of money right now. Because if I end up keeping this, of course, I'm going to upgrade to the small within time. But I just felt like I wanted something small and cute to carry. Now, I do have a lot of small and cute bags, but... I just like the YSL for some reason because this bag you can dress it up, dress it down, wear all different types of ways. So here on the side you have a um, tassel. Let me take this here stuff off. So here is the Saint Laurent little tassel. Now this tassel is not detachable so it do have to stay on the bag. And I am fine with that. Uh, see why I will want to take it off because it gives the bag that extra bedazzle and if y'all didn't know this chain is all gold it picked gold over silver i don't know i just like the gold better oh my goodness you all this bag is so cute like do you see this here bag and then you have the ysl here on the front and gold as well now, if any of y'all have this here ysl bag let me know if y'all experience issues with this hair gold on the front like do it tarnish do it turn or anything like that like i said before this is my first and ever ysl bag so i don't know the longevity of ysl like i do my other bags so this kind of reminds me of the gucci more mount but the small i think it's the mini i think reminds me of that i got this hair bag because like i said i don't wear big bags a whole lot i don't know when i purchase big bags i feel like i have to carry everything so i just wanted something 
that I can just carry like my keys, um, my cell phone, just things that I just need to grab and go. I had to worry about carrying all that stuff because y'all didn't know if you're new to my channel, I do have the um, Time Montessori backpack and I love that backpack, but I did experience a situation for his color transfer i love the bag but i just sometimes scared to wear it a lot so with that being said i was just like okay I do wear it but i just want to keep it looking pretty so i was just like let me just grab something else plus y'all to be honest it's just another reason to purchase something else. So the inside has like a little card slot where you can place i think maybe two two to three cards I'm not sure if I would use this. If I do uh, use this, it probably would be like the main cards that I use all the time. So where to where's the I don't have to worry about going in in and out of my wallet. But if not, it probably would just stay just like it is. Um, here's the inside, and the inside, as you can see, it opens really wide to let you know that it can fit quite a bit. I will show you really quick, but you know I usually do an unboxing. In my second video, I will share. Um, more of more detail regarding the bag probably just add a few things just to give you a little sneak peek happen on the part two of this here video bag review see the bag hangs at a good spot like it's not too long or not too short it's easy for me to get in and out to if i'm at the um, register trying to check out i can grab what i need and pay for my stuff and keep it moving the fact that i can toss it to the back and don't have to worry about um you know the bag too much and if i didn't mention the back of the bag do have a back pocket fingers crossed this can carry my essentials i'm gonna show you the bag that i am carrying at the moment so um fingers crossed everything that's in here can fit in this bag because this is what i'll be carrying as far as like essentials and this here is my cell phone and my cart my cart uh thing I'm Victoria's Secret coupons because I learned to carry my coupons with me y'all because I'm telling you I forget sometimes that I have coupons and I have some more Bath and Body Works coupons and I have my keys y'all I do love this hair Gucci key pouch but I do wish that I could carry like my cards inside of here because if I was able to do so I wouldn't need to carry this particular wallet I was looking on Louis Vuitton for the all leather um key pouch but of course it's sold out because i was thinking of purchasing that because sometimes when i just want to grab my keys and go but even grabbing my keys and go i still have to carry this because i need my credit card i also need my gate uh key card to get in there's no way i can leave with just this because if i leave with just this i can't get into my building i mean i can't get through the gate so it's like i wish you know it was to the point where i can put cards in here like towards the back anyway you all see if this stuff can fit I said the back has a back pocket i'll see we're gonna see if this phone can fit this here is the iphone 12 pro max okay so as you can see it can't fit at all so we're not going to put that inside of here what i may do with that back pocket is maybe stick my coupons in here no, I don't want to even do that because I don't like that look. Sure, what I will put in here at the moment. So right now, I'm not sure. In the inside, like I said, um, you can place your cards in here, but most likely, I won't be putting my cards in here. So I have my Louis Vuitton. I have my iPhone. I have my AirPods. Okay, so now we're starting to feel a little tight. I was able to fit everything in here. Like I said, if I had a smaller wallet, which I do, let me show you. I do have my Gucci card case, so let's just take that out. What I'm saying, if this here was like the Louis Vuitton, I wouldn't need a card case at all because all my stuff would be in here. This here is kind of big and bulky. Let's just say we're going to use this here. Uh, card holder keys in here this is why i wanted a um graceful because i don't know i just wanted something where i can put everything in hey we need my medicine this here lip balm and my lotion so all that can fit in here with me switching out this hair particular wallet so depending on what i want to carry that particular day i guess i would have to figure out what wallet i'm gonna carry here stuff in the bag did put a little weight to the bag but it's not the type of weight that's going to cause it to be uncomfortable with my stuff in here and it fits nicely across the body hopefully these straps are really strong i'm looking at them like 
But when I was talking to the lady that day, she did say, like, if you have any issues with your bag or anything like so, just bring it in and they will take care of it. Because I was looking at this, I was looking at this bag in a lighter color, but of course, I didn't even want to bother with it, y'all. I didn't have to worry about what I wear. That was the purpose of me purchasing um, all black. I just wanted to say congratulations who, to everyone who picked number one because y'all were dead on. I was like, mm, number one, number one, number one. Posted the picture on Instagram and some people were like saying, girl, I know you number one, number one. And I just smiled because I'm like, wow, I really had some girlfriends here. Like y'all really know me. Like y'all get me. Y'all understand me. Y'all understand this whole obsession with bags. So with that being said, you all, I'm going to off camera, play with the bag. Put more things in and switch it around. So this is where part two is going to come in at. I just wanted to grab what I had in my small bag just to give y'all a really quick idea on what can fit in the bag. Just in case you come across my video, you're like, okay, I'm not sure about this bag. But after watching Miss Tamika, I want to purchase the bag. That's why I wanted to do a small what fits in here just for that. And then, like I said, part two, where I will get into more of different items you can place in here in case you may not have a car case just in case you may not have a wallet things like so being said you all please give this video a big thumbs up it helps out my channel and also continue to purchase luxury items i do love them dearly i think i will ever be satisfied like sit here and say no more bags i'm completely satisfied like i can't right now they always switching out with different things and it's not always going to be of course high end and luxury because mark jacobs then came out with some new stuff coach like y'all are killing me for real mark jacobs you need to sponsor your girl because a tote on my channel and honey hunty like for real like mark jacob i'll let your girl for real like you don't even have to send me a bag just give me a gift card <laughs> That being said, you all, like I said, please give this video a big thumbs up because it helps on my channel. And also, before you go, please don't forget to click on that subscribe button and that notification bell, y'all, because it really, 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 really helps on my channel. And with that being said, until next time, and there will be a next time, I will talk to you later. Bye.